Well, what's up, people? Dobbs Wars is right here, and you guys may have just saw the latest video, my ranking video of Assassin's Creed, and um, this title pretty much says Assassin's Creed Valhalla is bug to shit, to be honest. It is extremely buggy. I have put 82 hours in this game at the moment. I have not finished the game yet because I've been just literally been trying to do the you know side quests and everything like I'd like doing, like I've been saying in the video. I give this game at the moment when I was only playing this game for about 12 hours, maybe 20 hours at tops. And I didn't see a lot of glitches, a few glitches, but not not as much. And the story's amazing. Don't get me wrong, the story is fantastic. The music's amazing. But what ruins the whole thing, which makes me really hate this game a lot, is the fucking glitching. The glitches is over, over the top now. I'm going to just tell you really quick now on what I've actually encountered in this game. And you guys, if you guys have played this game, you may agree with me if you've had these glitches. Glitches number one. Um, your characters, um, when they're talking, they're, they're not moving their lips. So they're like ventriloquism. That's that's like literally, it's like Jeff Dunham talking to Achned the dead terrorist. Uh, the other one. Um, your boat does some, some, some weird way, it actually goes on land. It's happened to me before. It's like, what the fuck's going on here? And then I go up north side of England to the mountains, the snowy mountains. I go into a cave where there's no water whatsoever. And then, boom, I'm in water, but I'm flying. I'm literally on top of the roof of the cave, swimming. And there's no water anywhere. <laughs> the other one is um, uh, the archers. From far, far away, they still hit you. That's definitely not right. Um, the other one, there is duplication of chests, which there shouldn't be. So even if I get... I think one of the recent shields I got a while back, the Sparta shield, I got it. I upgraded it to maximum. And then all of a sudden, one of the chests I actually did open up before, but I forgot it opened up. It was the Sparta shield again. And it nullified all my updates. So I was freaking furious about that because I spent so much time and effort to get upgraded. Um, sometimes, there's, I'm not trying to spoil it for you, but I killed one of my main characters, which is part of the story, and I go ahead and I like listen to stories, and it turns out he's still alive, because he's still talking. He's supposed to be dead. <laughs> and uh, the other things in this as well is that um, it's just literally extremely buggy. I'm so happy I didn't buy this full price, because when it first came out full price, it was 50 quid. I bought this for 25 quid, I bought it half price, and it was literally during Christmas. This came out around about November-ish or something, around about there. So it gave, I gave it a bit of time for it to scrub off the um, glitches and everything. And it turns out they've done fuck all. And I've also heard that Ubisoft is going to make an Assassin's Creed game once a year. How the fuck are they going to do that? If this is going to be, if this is the site of what is going to happen in the near future, I'm scared for Assassin's Creed. And I love this franchise. I really do. And I gave this thing a chance. And to be honest, right now, 82 hours in, I am so ready to finish this game off and stick it up on the shelf because I don't want to play it anymore. I'm not even going to go after Thor's hammer anymore. I'm sick to death of it, to be honest. And I tell you truthfully as well, I gave this a rate of a ranking number six. This does not deserve number 6, to be honest. Assassin's Creed 3 but deserves number 6. This is going down to number 10 mark, yes. 10 out of 12. So, still Unity is my worst game, but it's no, it's close enough to be Unity this, because the amount of glitches in this game. But the story saves it a little bit. Without the story, this thing is not playable, to be honest. It is god-awful. This game, this gameplay is the game. Like I said, gameplay is great, and the story is fantastic. The music is great. The glitchiness ruins the whole freaking game. It may be different for the people on Xbox, maybe different for the people on PC, maybe different for the people on the PS5. But on the PS4, it's trash. It really is. So pretty much, it's just a little quick update on how what I think about Valhalla at the minute. It's a piece of fucking dog shit. This game is fucking horrible! So pretty much that's all I have to really say for it. And plus, of course, yeah, yeah, fuck this game. He's the angry video game nerd.